And we're back with GameCube Plays Yakuza 2. I'm Mike. I'm another person of AP, and it. Uh, let's. Actually, do you want to test out our new drunk friend? I want to see if I'm getting a random encounter over here. Okay. Okay, yeah. Let's see if I can find somebody that will fight me. Actually, no, I say armor's with us. Yeah, so it might not work. So let's do what I yeah. was thinking here. I'll have a mini game episode here. Oh, okay. Uh, so we'll just play a round of. Uh, once I can get in here to figure out how to enter this building. Is it over here? Is it around the corner? It's around the corner. Now it was one misleading map. Oh, going bowling. Yep, first, most important thing. Gotta see if there's a lot of shoes on. Ah. Oh. Now, the most important thing about bowling is getting the shoes on. And there it is. See if you can go in the toilets here. It looks like you should be able to. And if so, you definitely need to go in the women's toilet. I tried. Ah. There seems to be an invisible barrier keeping me from relieving myself. It's actually the world's most clear glass door. They went all out on the best glass they possibly could, and they keep it spotlessly clean. It's a bit weird that they have a glass door and a toilet, though. You know what? We have Sayama here. Mm. So we're gonna... We're gonna bowl against Sayama. Why not? We should come back here with Haruka. Completely chump her at bowling. Or Darte. Okay, so spin, change balls. Okay, it's a bowling game. If you're not wearing a bowling shirt and shoes, I'll be disappointed here. Or do you even get to see yourself? I'm not sure you get to see yourself, and I don't remember. Oh, and you can change your... okay. Oops, that's gonna be bad. Yeah. Oh, not not awful. It could have been a gutter ball. This is gonna be a long episode. Yeah. I feel like this bowling game is gonna be slow and kinda bad. And this is gonna be a bad shot as well. Eh? Oh no. Well, it was a bad frame. Sam was gonna chump me here. Yes, she's definitely gonna chump you. Bowling in later Yakuza games is better. Oh, nope. Yes, at least she didn't completely clear you off there. And look at that, she looked destroyed. Just walking off, crying into her hands. Now you've got to make up for this, Mikey. You ever been any good at bowling? Nope. I'm about as good as I am here. I actually really don't like bowling. When I was about nine, to about the age of 12, I'd usually win if I went bowling with people I went with, but then I suddenly got really shit. Actually, I've got a pretty good bowling related story. So, to fill the time <laughs> that, here, that's my school, <laughs> you bent it like Beckham. You're playing the wrong game to be bending it like Beckham in, though. So, my secondary school had like a sort of rewards thing, where there was a merit scheme, and if you got a lot of merit, you'd be taken on a school trip uh -huh. at the end of the year. I hated it. You'd have to put it inside your school planner, you'd have to carry the planner around, all sorts. So what I just started doing is I started just lying and never carrying my planner around. And at the end of the year, they'd come around and ask you how many merits you got. 
in year, like, I think it was year 11, I was feeling really brave and silly. By the way, year 11's about 15, 16 years old. Okay. So when he came round, I said that I had 250 merits. That is an ungodly amount. Truth is, I had two. That sounds um, about right. And basically, yep. Um, they decided to, because I had 250 merits, which was far and away the most in the entire year group, by about an order of 100, um, I'd be put on the list for the school trip. <laughs> Do you know who else was on the list for the school trip? Nerds. A bunch of children in year seven. Oh. Yes. It was me and two people from my year, and then a bunch of people who were ten and eleven. <laughs> and it was a bowling school yes. trip, and I turned up late, so I didn't even like. I had to go to like the orthodontist. Oh, thank so... God! There's only three frames. Yeah, that could have been much more painful. But yeah, so I turned up late to the school trip. I didn't even turn up with everyone. I just got dropped off on the way there. And they were already in the middle of games, so they were like, you know, we'll just slot you into a game. They slotted me into a game with a bunch of year seven girls. Um, so they're like five years younger than me. And I lost the game. I lost a game of bowling against a bunch of girls who were five years younger than me. That's embarrassing. I felt so much shame. Yeah. So there's a thing I can do where similar to all the other places, if you do it three times, a guy pops up to challenge you. But I don't like that bowling game that much. Nah, it's not good. So I'm not going to do that. Uh, I hope people know yeah, by mom, now, mom. episode like 27 or whatever this is, that this is not going to be a 100% completion run. So if you yeah, did, just I'm sorry. Yeah, because some of it seems like it's a bit much, especially the golf mini game. Which looks balls hard. Yep. That guy looks shady as fuck. Nah, he's just a nerd. He looked like he was stealing. Nah, we should have said we know what it is. Pretend oh, we're right. YF. That video game we played. Ah, oh, yeah, that shitty thing. Are they like amiibos? Can I touch it to the arcade system and save my stats? Dude, you know what happens to amiibos when I'm in the conversation. You've seen the video. You've seen footage of what I do to amiibos. I hope they're not amiibos. But look at the craftsmanship. Yeah, but also look at what happens when you set Yoshi's Woolly World Yoshi on fire, man. Waste of money. It was so worth it. So worth it. I doubt anyone in this red's even seen the video. Oh, these are fun. I always did these when I went to a convenience store in Japan. Oh, do you like little constructible figures? No, you go and you buy a ticket. And then you pull a thing mm -hmm. off and you get a letter, and then you get a prize on the shelf be behind the counter that corresponds to the letter. Or a number. Ah. You get neat little stuff like towels and folders, and sometimes you get like a keychain or figurine or something. Sounds like something I wouldn't ever actually take part in, just because it's more stuff that I'd have to carry around. Hate uh, carrying things around. I got some folders that I got use out of. I'm waiting till this car playing loud music goes away. Man, I'm still mystified how I got away with that saying I had 250 merits thing. Like, none of them even thought to check does this guy actually have these merits? Like, ask for my planner. Oh, well, I got my just desserts for that one. He just gave me a bunch of stuff. Yeah, he gave you a watch. 
in three figures. Like. <laughs> Dude, that's, what do you mean that's probably use? a nice watch. What do you mean use? You can't use figures. You can't play with them. They don't. They don't look like they got posable arms, posable legs. They're not action figures even. Do you know what you're supposed to do with those figures? Nope. Uh, I do know what I'm going to do with them, and that's go to Serena and put them straight in my box. Dude, you just walk straight out of that place and just fucking planted the guy on the floor. You shouldn't be standing. Like there. I could hear him grunt. Just get out of like my it's way. It's very rare in this game. I get to hear pedestrians, and all I heard with that case was. Ugh. Like, you probably really hurt him inside. Probably deserved it. He's probably a nice guy. Leave him alone. He's standing in my way. I'm also going to put these cookies in here. Because we want to save those for the end. We're going to totally forget about those cookies by the end of the game. I hope not. Casmus is going to have a box full of stale cookies. They'll carry over into like Yakuza, Yakuza 3. 5. We'll... Mm -hmm. we'll remember them by Yakuza 5 and it'll say, Bag of cookies, rotten. Okay, so let's head over to the Champion District. And I don't have the stopwatch going, so hopefully we're not going to go too long. Is there a key I in here? I have no idea. There is a key in here. I thought there might be. Can we befriend get... this drunk? No, but Sayama, get out of the way. I want this key. Why would you leave a locker key on the floor? I don't think it I don't think they were left, I think they were dropped. No, I mean like on the options that comes up when you click oh, on yeah, one. Yeah, I have no it idea. Says you can take it or you can I don't leave know why it. it gives that option to you at all. In Yakuza, Maybe it's in case you just want to leave them all there, in case you want to do one big rush. In Yakuza 5, I would understand it. Not in this one. Why, are there more of them in 5? Uh, there's a section or do you... where... Uh, where you can use locker keys, but that character can't use any of the items in the locker. So you want to save ah. them for a character that is in that area later. Alright, so you probably want to save them for something like Kazma or something like that? Yeah, something like that. But yeah, I imagine you might want to leave them on the ground in this game to uh, go back with a guy just like that and pick them all up at once. Maybe, So you don't yeah. confuse yourself. Yeah. For some odd reason, I picked up on that recording then. I hope myself to speak back to myself. That's weird. Hmm. It isn't happening now, though. That's good. It was just half of a sentence. And it scared the shit out of me. We're in the champion district here. Been a while since we've been in champion district. Huh. Remember, we went here once for that one host bar. In fact, I think it was this place. I think you might be right. Yeah, it was this place in Yakuza 1. Yes, yeah, the karaoke bar. Mm hmm. Oh, she's calling you handsome. Okay, it says we might have to come in, order, leave, and come back. This gets me a Yamazaki 12 year over here. It's a good whiskey. That's the bottle I got right there. That's a fancy bowl. Eh, it's not that fancy. Eh, it looks fancy enough. Maybe it's just the glass. Yeah, it's the glass. Maybe it's making it look fancy being next to a nice looking glass. Yeah, that's the, the nose and glass.
If it's popular overseas, I haven't really heard of it before. I, have, I mean, I have a bottle that I got here and not in the airport on the way back, so... That might just be a case of the UK being the UK, though, and preferring our own whiskies. Mm -hmm. Plus, I imagine, like, the cost of importing that from so far away. Probably. Probably be quite expensive. She just keeps talking. Yeah, talking about the Romans doing partying. Do you want to party with this woman in glasses dressed like Sansa? I, I do. I do too, once I come back in here. Boy. We have to help her out. She gave us a drink? Yeah. Now you have the drunk icon this up there. This party went wrong. Wow. That's rude. Rude, rude man. Mmm. Sayama, so, back me up. I'm a little drunk. What does drunk actually do to you in this game? Encounter rate goes up, and I'm not sure if there's actually any positives. Yeah, I imagine encounter of it is its own positive. You get more experience. Like, that seems to be the entire reason for it. I wonder if I'm strong. I imagine. I know in Yakuza 4 there's a character who he, a lot of his moves you can only do while drunk. That sounds like a cool character. He's pretty cool. Also, the controller vibrates every once in a while when you're drunk. We make a new friend? Making yes, friends. we did. Hmm. We're gonna unite all of Tokyo together under one big friendship group. I'm just checking to see if there's another friend in here. We're gonna go night out. I don't think. Did you already pick up a locker key in here? I don't think so. But I'm, hmm. I'm not Usually the game will put one inside a building. There's another shop around here. Bad look of it. Yeah. A little blue spot on the map. And there's another. Another uh, quest in here somewhere. Is it Shellac here? That is a really shitty name for a bar. Yeah, it is. It's a shitty name for anything, really. See if I can find this other quest in here. These little buildings are really weird. Why? I don't know, this, this doesn't look right to me. These little tiny little... They look like little warehouses or storage. Like, closet sort of things. Japan loves little hole-in-the-wall places. It's just in the middle of an alley full of high-rise buildings. This is an odd place for it. It's kind of how Japan, it, at least metropolitan Japan, is. I mean, like, I imagine it's cool as fuck. This There's not. That's not what I was looking thing. for. But it'll it'll work. Not finding the guy I'm looking for in here. Maybe it's like the other quest with the uh, guys wearing the nappies. We might have just come back later. Yeah. So. I do know where there's another. Another quest. Seems like there's a lot more quests in this game. Yeah. We're doing way more than we're doing plot. And actually interesting for a change. Oh, yeah. Oh, you know what? This one might not appear because uh, 
This is where the grandma wants us to be. And she wants us to be alone. Yeah, it is. And the reason that, um, the little square champion district man might have not had a quest is because you had to do the quest inside the building. Oh, maybe. Like, it might just be a case of there can only be so many quests in proximity of each other at once. Yeah. Okay, let's... Let's try for one more, and then, uh... Probably wrap it up after that one for this episode. Yeah. See if we can do the one down here, and then, if not, I can try and get another one. One more side quest completion is what we're going to do for this episode. It's kind of slow. slow yeah, episode. it was, wasn't slow before this. Yeah. This is now that we don't know where to go. It's weird that the drunk effect is still happening. Well, yeah, it takes a while to sober up. Ah, usual games, you sober up in a snap. But you're acting like a drunk, just knocking guys over in the street still. Hey! Hey, guys. Seems like you can't just make yourself do it. It just happens randomly. Hey. Get out of the way. I wonder how much stuff Sayama's just screwing up by being here. Maybe quite a bit. But I believe that if we take her... I mean, like, if we go to the Millennium Tower with it, it'll take us away to Osaka at this point, won't it? Yeah, but I think we'll come back here. I, um, I don't think... well, since we can't find any side quests right now, maybe just try going to the host club? And when, then we'll just do plot next episode? No, because then this will be a super long episode. I know where one thing is, and we'll do... Okay. One thing that shouldn't get fucked up by Sayama being here. Thank you for those tissues. Just making a big collection, man. Maybe we'll need them. Maybe somebody will spill yeah, a drink and one, we need to stop it night. up. Nah, I'm thinking we'll just one long night in. Kazuma's, uh... On the street all the time, man. A lot of pent-up aggression, you know? Let's He's see. got a lot of tissues. Are you the guy we need to talk to? Okay. Dude's way into alliteration. I can respect it. I would if I was. And I know exactly 15. what to give him. It's probably Ninja Free DVD. No, it's that terrible hip hop CD. Wait, didn't we buy it from the same street? Right here. No, th that guy gave it to us down a couple streets. This guy's digging it, though. Hmm. Or, or maybe not. Maybe it's just what he needs to break him out of his crappy... Yeah, look, it's even working. Destroying his alliteration. Nope, it's back. It's back in full force. Ugh. Ooh. He's gonna get into a rap battle with the uh, crappy rapper back down that street. He used a fancy pen. That's that's better than the CD. Nah, that CD could have been a classic. Like, you don't know how much that CD is going to be worth when that guy who's rapping takes off. But, uh, let's... Let's leave that for another time. 
Yeah, sure. This has been Game Kiwi Plays Yakuza 2. I'm Mike. I'm another person at OAP, and as always, keep it juicy.